All right, folk, folks, the top looks like this because I don't have cover, uh, screws in it, but I'll put screws in it. So I decided to test another one of these. I'm just going to go through the ones that look better. This here is the Realistic AM Sideband TRC448. Kind of see the condition of it. It's in real good condition. It's just, it's dusty. It just needs to be cleaned like all of these radios did. I do have it hooked up. Um, more on... AM right here. Hello, 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 hello. Here's the 50 watt scale right here, AM. Hello, 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 hello. Audio, 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 audio. So I'm assuming this radio has been turned up because you can see we got a 10 watt dead key. Hello, audio, audio. And about a 24 watt swing right there. So I'm assuming this one's been turned up. Let's go ahead and go to lower sideband here. Hello, 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 hello. Hello, 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 hello. Hello, uh, 13, 14 watts. And uh, go to upper sideband. Hello, hello, hello. This microphone's a little tricky. Hello, 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 it's not the radio, it's the mic, hello, I'll get it, hold on a second, hello, 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 there we are, an upper sideband, hello, 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 audio, 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 hello, 13, 14 watt, same thing, um, yeah, these microphones are kind of, they probably need to be opened up and cleaned. Um, but most of the time it works. Hello, 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 hello. So looks like this radio here works pretty good. I don't have an antenna hooked up to it for uh, receive, but you can tell it definitely has receive. I'm not going to dare to transmit on it, but I went ahead and plugged this little magnet mount in just so you can see it does pick up a signal here. All right, I want to show the receive works. Um, I've got the antenna unplugged from it. So it's going to overpower it a little bit, but we're both on channel 19. Hello, hello, audio check, check, one, two, one, two. Hello, hello, audio, one, two, three, one, two, three. Hello, come in. All right, folks, once again, not ideal. I do not have a antenna plugged in because I'm too darn close. We've got her on lower sideband, channel 38. Uh, you can see I got the striker on the same thing, 38 lower sideband. Just to show you it works. Hello, audio. Audio check. One, two, three. One, two, three. Audio check. One, two, three. Hello, come in. So anyways, just want to show this here is a good radio and it's in fantastic condition. If anyone's interested in this one, let me know. And like I said, I'll go ahead and put uh, brand new screws in this one and I'll clean it up. All right, let's show you the inside. First time I'm looking at it. It's probably dusty in there, but... Okay, let's go ahead and flip it over. We'll look at the other side. All right, you can see it's, a, it's actually in really good condition. I haven't even cleaned it yet. Here's the inside. It actually looks pretty fantastic in there. It looks almost brand new. This is just dust here on the back, but there's a date code made in Japan. There's the data tag right there. All right, folks, if anyone wants this one, let me know. I'll probably put a little tiny bit of touch-up paint right around that dial to make it look good right there. Right, right there. All right, later.